a few things to remember before you walk into your N1 surgery. First and foremost, the drill unit settings, three distinctly different settings for the osseo director, the osseo shaper and the implant. Especially for the osseo shaper, remember that the tool is used with 40 newton centimeters torque at a maximum of 50 RPMs. The surgical handpiece with the hexagonal interface and interlocking in order to transfer the forces properly into the handpiece of the Osteoshaper 2. A complete N1 surgical tray including two prosthetic drivers, one for the base, should you choose to place the base at time of surgery, and the OmniGrip mini driver for all other restorative prosthetic components from the healing abutment to the impression copings. For the surgical site preparation, we have the Osseo Director, which is not coming automatically in the tray. The implant with the co-packed Osseo Shaper 1 and an additional Osseo Shaper 2 in clinical situations where you encounter dense bone and the Osseo Shaper 1 cannot go to the desired depth, then you want to have this tool available to bring the implant site preparation to completeness. When it comes to the first step, the Osseo Director, remember that this tool is determining the depth and angulation of your final implant placement, so be extremely precise in pos positioning this tool correctly. And this concludes a brief summary of what needs to be ready when you want to walk into surgery.